it going, everyone? Maryland here, and that's right, it's time for more of Maryland's Terraria Expert Mode Adventure. Yeah, playing on version 1.3.3. And I know I was gonna do some things last time, like, you know, build the house, but yeah, you know what, it's, uh, I think we have a little bit of time. I can work on this when it's nighttime out, and it's almost nighttime out, so I might as well at least try to get something done. So I'm gonna go past this hill over here, and uh, hopefully that'll work out well. Now I do have recall potions, so I should probably put those on my hotbar. I'll get stuff sorted out kinda, you know, once it's nighttime out. But I figure, you know what? There's a lot more stuff we can find on the surface, gosh darn it, so I'd better get it. And I really want to go down there, because there could be like a chest or something. Oh, that was kind of scary. Oh, man. So how are you all doing today? Hopefully you're doing good now that you've got your hopefully daily dose of Maryland's Terraria Expert Mode action. Oh, yeah. Not even an adventure now. We're in the action genre. Um, yeah, it's going to be fun. I'm hoping this will be a daily series. I'm not promising it by any means. But it will be mostly daily, I'm pretty sure. Because thankfully, you know, the episodes, they don't really take that much time. Oh, right, you know what? I learned this. I need to actually keep using this, because I never do it. I need to just dig the sand block beneath the cactus. It makes mining cacti so much faster. But yeah, it probably won't be like, you know, 100% daily, but hey, you know what? I think it's fine. I think we'll, we'll try to do as daily as possible. Because sometimes, you know, stuff comes up, and, you know, sometimes, like, I could be sick or something, and that's never any good. I'm not gonna make you a promise that it'll be daily if it isn't, especially when we get kind of later on when looking for things to do. Um, ooh, you know what, let me grab this. Oh, you jerk vulture! Wow! Okay, yeah, this needs to stop. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Uh, you know what? Yeah, let's just kind of sneak back home. <laughs> I don't really like being around here. It's getting dark anyway. That vulture hit me way more than I wanted it to. So, yeah. Um, let me go ahead and make, I guess, another house area over here. Because I did kind of set down this floor for a reason. I wanted to build on it. I just don't know what I want to build. I need kind of like some inspiration. This is not going to be a final area. I'm going to tear it down. But you got to start somewhere, right? Um, let's see. Well, at least the rain let up. That's nice. Um, what honestly should I do? I guess we'll just kind of... No, that's going to be a pain to get into. Here's what we need to do. We need to have, like, a box. Oh, yeah, no one ever thought of a box in Terraria before. Oh, I'm, I'm a genius. Um, all right. Well, let's take my genius ways and work with them. Uh, so we need a door. Guess if I had that there, okay. But now what am I accomplishing here? Maybe if we had like, I don't know, some kind of like a lid or something. That'd look pretty cool. You know, something like this. I don't know if I want to have it like connected or not. Um. Mmm, because I kind of like to go over there between stuff. This is looking stupid. What am I even doing? It's like, I'm not even trying. This is just so bad. All right, let's just, uh, let's just maybe do a little bit of this. I'm just trying to kill a little bit of time before it's night out. All right. And the award for the dumbest building design ever goes to Maryland. Oh yeah, I'm the best, you know it. Okay, there, I just want to have something to keep out enemies. Um, this hammer doesn't even swing <laughs> all the way up there. That's a shame. Um, okay, so I need some doors, right? I guess I need to take down these fences. That's what I was trying to do while I kept placing those torches. Actually, I could leave the fences there. We're gonna have these, like, separated. All right, door to door, door, door. I'm a door to door salesman. That's what I am. Actually, we're kind of gonna make somewhere. Why did I make three doors? Oh, well. I had two. Might as well make three. Um, let's see, we're just gonna do a little bit of that. I think I actually kind of want to move this. Oh man, now I've really done it. Now I've really done it, guys. 
Okay, it's fine though. We will persevere throughout this madness of building a little house complex area. I say complex, uh-oh. I gotta seal up the door, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think anything will get in through there, but now we, uh, yeah, now we'll be safe. Okay, it's nighttime. I'm gonna work on this monstrosity over here, and I will see you when, uh, when things are a little safer out. All right, well, it is daytime, and I, uh, did a little bit of work around the, uh, the base area. This thing doesn't look like as much of a disaster anymore. I think the ropes make it look cool. Makes it look kinda, I don't know, run down. I have a little attic area up here. I don't really know exactly how much I like it, but eh, you know what, it's fine. It'll get the job done for now. I just, I don't know, I have more rope than I know what to do with. Uh, but that's fine because, you know, we can use that for some stuff. Now, you know, obviously later on I'll be able to make you know, better doors and things to keep zombies out. But for right now, you know what, just sealing it up every night, that's not really like the end of the world or anything, so I guess that's fine. Um, so I guess I wanna put some of my chests away somewhere. I have all these chests and I haven't really done anything with them, so I'm gonna just set them in the basement for right now. Let's go ahead and put these here. Being organized will be so important, but you know what, for right now, it's not really a big deal. Let me just go ahead and make my, you know, ores and, ores and mert. Okay, no ores and metals, uh, which will also include like gems and stuff. In fact, wow, I have a gold coin already. Holy moly, I don't even remember getting that. Um, okay, so I got lead in this world. How I like to sort items, I like to have the ore kind of up on top. Oh, you know what? I should probably put this chest up with, you know, the furnace and anvil you know, where I will actually be using it. Uh, can I do this from here? Uh, no, I can't, darn it. I'm gonna have to move everything. Oh, this is gonna be bad. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna leave that there. Do I really wanna put a chest like by the window? Oh, I can just put a chest right there. That's fine. Here I am freaking out over nothing. Oh, but then I can't open the door that way. Well, whatever, it's fine. It's not really a big deal. Um, uh, okay, well, we're just gonna deal with it for now. Again, this is just a temporary solution to a long-term problem. It's not, you know, the final end-all solution for everything, but it's okay, because you know what? That's fine, we don't need an end-all solution for everything just yet. Okay, so let's go ahead and craft up some of these bars. Is there anything worthwhile that I could make with tin or with uh, iron? Um, not really. Or not iron, lead, I'm sorry. I don't even have iron in this world. Oh, look at that, Eugene the Merchant has arrived. Well, I know what I'm gonna make. Uh, yeah, let me definitely, darn it, what am I even doing? I, there we go. Okay, I wanna make a fishing pole. So we're gonna make that, because fishing is so important in expert mode. Where is this chap? He's all the way over there. Fishing is so important in expert mode because of all the benefits you get from the well-fed buff, which, you know, in normal mode, yeah, it's okay and all, it's kind of nice, but in this, it's just so important because it lets you uh, regenerate your health at a normal rate. That's something I forgot to mention in the first episode is your health regeneration is a lot lower in, oh, I don't even have enough for a piggy bank. That's weak. Um, do I want a sickle? It's kind of nice for just building materials. Eh, you know what, we're gonna pass on that. Thanks, pal, appreciate it. Um, okay, but yeah, you know what? I should probably put like some light down here because it's really dark. Oh, look at my derpy torches. There we go, that's a little bit better. Um, for right now, I'm just gonna dump all of my potion material things over there. Wow, I actually have a lot of cactus. I should make a cactus thing. The spear, uh, I don't really know how I feel about it, but you know what, I guess we'll put it in the inventory somewhere anyway, just because, why not? Uh, all right, potion stuff, builder potion, mining potion, speed potion, very good things to have, don't get me wrong. I just wanna save them for right now. Um, let me go ahead and do this. Again, I'm not gonna show you every time I go into a chest. Or maybe I am, I don't know, I might be just that cruel. 
You'll have to find out. Um, actually, the blowpipe is not too bad at this point in the game. Uh, let's put my shameful sword in there. Wait, why is my axe and hammer in there? I don't want that. That's awful. All right. So I can't use shuriken. That's banned. It's prohibited. I cannot use it. Um, We're not probably going to be able to fish because I don't have any bait right now. All right. Let's just dump this stuff away. Fallen star grenades. These are pretty good to have. Oh, a traveling merchant. But I don't have any money. You can't do this to me. Watch him sell Dynasty Wood in the very first time. Just, just watch it. You gotta be kidding me! Ah! <laughs> Look at all this good stuff! So I went through my entire normal mode series without seeing any of the Dynasty Wood or Dynasty Shingles once. Not one time. And the first time. This is the second day in Terraria. He shows up and he has them. Man, I am so sad. And on top of that, he has one of the best fishing poles in the game, which I can't afford unless a miracle happens. Man, what a ripoff. If only I could mug one of my NPCs right about now. I would be just all over that. I mean, they would hate me, but oh well, not my problem anymore. Um, so I should probably make some cactus stuff. That's 75 cactus. It will give me, uh, I think maybe two more defense than what I have. So we're gonna do that. Um, yeah, now I'm up to five. And defense is a lot more important, by the way. In expert mode, it actually has an increased amount that it protects you by. And I'm gonna hold on to my wood stuff just because, again, I'm trying to collect everything. So in order to do that, obviously I need all the items that I can get. Um, all right, we'll put the boreal wood and the rest of the cactus away. All right, so I got my fishing pole. I need to go get some bait. So let's go do that. Also, wouldn't it be a bad idea to try to get some seeds for my blowpipe, which is actually kind of helpful at this point in the game. It's not super terrible. So there was a desert over there, and I was getting kind of wrecked by a whatever it was, a vulture. That thing was just ridiculous. All right, let me chop this slime up into itty bitty pieces and let's see if I can get some worms from here. Yeah, I got me a worm. Actually, I might as well catch the bunny and sell it for a little bit of money. All right, I'm going to need to chop down some more trees. In fact, for that matter, I'm going to need to plant some more trees too. But oh, well, I'll go all green friendly later. All right. Wow, that slime. Why wouldn't it just die already? So I don't think I can actually get to the ocean. I think I'm going to be a little too far away for that because this is a large... Oh, look at that. It's all like distorted, all the heat and everything. That's actually a cool effect. I didn't notice that last time I was here. That is thanks to um, Terraria 1.3.3, the newest version, which I am playing on. I don't want to stay around here for too long because remember, so many of the changes they've introduced... They're actually in this version. Um, let's just dirt. I don't know, dirt bridge. So ugly, am I right? But oh well, you know what? You gotta do what you gotta do. Hey, get some more cactus. I don't. I don't need one cacti. Oh yeah. Scorpion. I don't think that thing actually hurts. But I don't really want to find out right about now. No, thank you. Okay, so I have recall potions. That's definitely a good thing. Um, oh, wow, look at all this tungsten up here. And worms. Oh, this is so much tungsten on the surface. Normally, you don't see tungsten that often. I mean, it's not like, you know, you'll never see it, but just to see, like, three veins of it and kind of decent sized veins on the surface. Oh, my goodness. What the heck? This is like... A huge vein of tungsten for the surface. Like, holy smokes. I mean, I'm going to need a lot of tungsten. Ah, uh, that slime. Kind of intimidates me. Oh my goodness. There's got to be like 40 plus pieces in here. This is like amazing. Wow. 
Tungsten for the win. So, so far, I've gotten every alternate ore. I don't actually know uh, if, you know, I have... I guess platinum would be the last of the normal ones that would be an alternate. But, you know, instead of silver, I got tungsten. Oh my goodness, this is so much tungsten. What is up with that? Like, seriously? Oh, wait. There's some money in that slime. Well, I'll get that in a moment. I know I'm not going to have no 35 gold, but... Oh, man. Why did that guy have to have, like, everything I wanted? That's just cruel. My goodness, there's so much tungsten in here. This is great. Well, anyway, that's, uh, pretty good. Definitely not complaining about this. I'm just trying to think of what to talk about while mining all this. I feel like I should say something, but... You know, it's just kind of, like, there. That, you know, it's just so inviting. It's like, here, I got a whole ton of tungsten for ya. All right, well, I just destroyed that mountain. I'm so sorry. Hopefully it wasn't, uh, oh, great, a jungle. Um, hmm, I don't really feel too good about that jungle now, do I? No, I don't, actually, because everything in the jungle hits very hard at this point. I guess I could fish over there. Oh, wow. Well, there's a treasure chest. I'm not gonna turn that down. Oh, nice, an angry aglet. Well, hey, that's fine by me. Let me go ahead and grab that thing. Whoa, holy worms, Batman. I don't know what a holy worm looks like, but we got him. Okay, uh, I really want to get that strange plant, though! Whoa! Oh, jungle slime. Just kind of leaping down. And, a uh, beehive. I do not like the looks of that. Ah, uh, there's a chest down there, though. But there's also a jungle slime. Mm, you jerk! Okay, we're just gonna do this. Uh, da -da -da. we're gonna just drop a little bit of rope down there. Worms? Worms! Yeah, so many worms. That's great, because I need some bait. Oh! Oh, uh, I thought it was like a purple slime. How does this thing work? No, that's really bad. Okay, there we go. Um, anything down here? I'll get the chest in a moment. I just kind of wanted to scope out the area, you know? Uh, glow sticks. Like, an uncomfortable amount of glow sticks. Well, I guess I could check out down here briefly, just to see if there's anything. Um, pew, 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 pew. I should really be saving these throwing knives because they are actually pretty useful at this point. And I don't think they're that easy to get. Maybe they are. I'm trying to remember. I think I don't remember if it's the merchant that sells them like at the night time or what. Well, I can just recall potion to get out. And I'm probably going to want to do that anyway. Um, Okay, there's Mr. Jungle Slime. Get back, get, get, get back, get, 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 get back. You make me uncomfortable, Jungle Slime. All right, speaking of uncomfortable, man, this is dangerous. All right, so, I mean, I can't really skip ahead and use anything that I get, like, you know, Jungle Spores or anything. Um, what the heck? What is the sound? Oh, great. <gasps> okay, I don't I don't really like this so much anymore. Um oh, I could use a grenade, but Okay, well, looks like the ship has sailed. Okay, well, there's uh, an underground desert biome that has some really cool music, by the way. That's new to 1.3.3. Hey now. Oh, but there's a chest right up there. I'm going to take a chance. I could have used a rope coil, but I just didn't really feel like crafting one. Okay, how safe is this? Is this like, you know, I'm gonna die any minute now safe, or is this like, I'm okay safe? Well, a better spear, that's fine by me. I hear something digging. Oh man, I'm out of here. <laughs> See ya. Okay, well, yeah, I mean, I don't think I could have taken that thing. Maybe if I tossed some grenades at it, I could have. But, eh, not for right now. Oh, a monarch butterfly. I suppose I'm probably gonna have to collect all the darn butterflies, aren't I? Hmm. That's great. There's nothing down here, right? No, but I'm going to light it up. Wait, how many torches? Yeah, I'm okay. I got plenty of torches. 
So maybe I should make like a little fishing pond for the night time, just to waste some time. Uh, I really do want to get to the other side of the world though, but that's going to take an eternity and a large map. Like seriously, large maps are enormous. I guess I'm probably just going to have to chill around the house for a while. Um, wait, what did you say? What did you say? Oh man, you were going to say something. You said, oh well, whatever. Okay, so we need to get inside everyone. Come on. No dilly-dallying. We got to seal this up. It's dangerous out here. Uh, I did get the strange plant, which is nice. I should probably build something underground just to make sure someone will move in down here because I just want to kind of get NPCs at this point. Get rid of that ugly thing. In fact, I guess I'll get rid of this ugly thing as well. We didn't really put a chest there. Um. Okay, so I got a lot of tin. Well, not a lot, but, you know, a reasonable amount. Uh, okay, I do want to get that, though. Hello, pretty. I'm looking at you. Oh, man. Uh, let's see. Not really a lot of progress. How much cactus did I get? I got, like, 35, and I already have the armor. Oh, and all my tungsten, too. That's right. Let's see what I can make from this. 22. I mean, not great, but not terrible at the same time. Wow. I need to get that. Because then I can increase my, uh, my magic. That'll be good. All right, let's do that. Good way to kind of stay safe. Tungsten. My goodness. So 22 tungsten. So I can make a helmet, which has four defense. I mean, that's... Normally, I don't like to mi mix and match item sets, but that's actually not that bad. Oh, let's see. Tungsten hammer. Yeah, that sounds like a great idea right about now. Lead door. I wonder if that keeps zombies out. I actually don't remember. Oh, you killed the bunny, you jerk. Hmm. All right, and he's just gonna what? Walk away? How can you just do that and just walk away afterwards? Like, what's the matter with you? Okay, let me put a workbench and a chair down here. Just so, you know, we can have someone maybe move in. Because I think this qual qualifies as a house. Yeah, it does. Totally. Um, look at that guy just hopping in the walls. Okay, um, gotta stop freaking out here. What do I need to do tonight? Is there anything I really can do right now? Is there anything I can buy from you? Yeah, I think it's only the Blood Moons that he sells throwing knives, so I have to kind of keep an eye on those. Oh, but I can totally sell this damaged spear. I don't need it for anything. Um, I only need one of every item for my completion, so no need to have more than that. So I should probably make a pickaxe. Cactus sword, nine, lead. Yeah, the lead's better, but I think a cactus pickaxe would be good just because it has better range, and I think it's a little faster, maybe? Maybe not. Um. Well, I'm going to make it anyway. Okay, there we go. Cactus pickaxe. So I'll hold on to this copper pickaxe again for completion. Don't need it, but don't want to get rid of it either. Uh, we're going to make a mana crystal. Bing. And uh, yeah, then I don't really know what else to do. Waiting through the night. Always so much fun in Terraria, especially in the early game. I mean... I will tell you right now, I will get destroyed royally if I try to fight these zombies. Although I could probably cheese them. Might not be a bad idea. You know what? Let me put away my money. What can I cheese them with, though? That's the problem. Do I have anything that's, like, really obvious? Because some of them can actually hit me. Uh, I did that. You're not going to get through, right? For some reason, it likes to fall in that hole there. That's really strange. I've never seen zombies do that. But hey, that's fine. Um, I wonder if it's like a 1.3 bug. Oh, well, this is fine. I'll just keep this up tonight. Okay, so it's daytime again. Thank goodness. That one actually wasn't too bad of a night. Um, yeah, so I don't really know where I want to go. 
right now. I'll probably play for one more Terraria day. What are you doing, pal? Come on. Um, I'll probably play for one more Terraria day and then just kind of see what I can find in the area. I want to get some water nearby. Like, this is not enough water. <laughs> I mean, really. Uh, but I'll take a worm. Yeah, I really want to stock up on worms. And I also need to plant more trees because I'm just really running out of wood. Like, I built so much for my house. I have like 500 wood and I'm down to like 100 now. So that's definitely a problem. Hey. Mm. This powerful blowpipe, it's not that powerful. Like, it's just so slow. But at least the ammo is dirt cheap. I mean, almost exactly dirt cheap. It's right on the ground. Gosh darn it. Oh, I should really have gotten some snow so I could start growing some boreal wood. Oh, I need to do that. In fact, that should be my goal. I think I'm going to go over to the snow biome and check that out. I dropped off all my money, so if I die, it's not really a huge deal. This isn't hardcore or anything. Um, but yeah, it should still be pretty enjoyable. Regardless of if it's hardcore or not, I really like the idea of collecting items. I think that's going to be a lot of fun. I think it'll give me reason to fight stuff again and again and again and just do things. I don't know how that'll all work out. I'm not going to worry too much about it right now because really at this stage in the game, you know, you're kind of just getting started out. Just want to survive and that's me right now. That is me right now. Oh, I'm going to have to catch all the animals. Be a real Pokemon master, huh? No worms? What a ripoff. Oh, man, that stinks. Come on. You gotta give me some worms, pal. Oh, I need a better axe. Oh, great. The demolitionist has arrived. That's actually really helpful because grenades are amazing in uh, Terraria expert mode because, like, they do a lot of damage and they're great for just clearing out enemies. So I'm glad I have that guy. Kind of fitting that he's in a basement. Um... Yeah, I'll have to buy some grenades. They're dangerous, but they can work. I really want to get the uh, die trader. I love that guy. <laughs> He's just like so cool because, you know, you can get, um, you can trade in your strange plants for some cool dyes and stuff. And I mean, I don't want to look like a cactus the whole time. All right, let's, oh, could have gotten the grasshopper. Thank you for not damaging me, even though you totally should have. You were within your right, blue slime. Oh, nope. Not that one. Nope. No siree. Worm! Give me the worm. All right, let's chop this down. I think I'll actually get the die trader. I just need to add another room, because I do have a strange plant. I think that's the only condition to get him. All right, slime. I see you. Let me just jump down the tree, come on! Oh, you didn't even. <laughs> you could have been a good slime, but no, you weren't. You know what? There are a lot of slimes around. Actually, that's fine, because I could use a little bit more gel, right? Totally. Everyone needs more gel. Are you gelling? I'm gelling like Magellan. <laughs> no, I didn't come up with that. All right, let's see. Well, I get some worms. All right, give me. There we go. Yeah, I think a side project that'll be a lot of fun. Well, not really fun, but it'll be worthwhile is uh, setting up kind of an underground fishing area. And maybe I should do it underground and think about it. Originally, I was thinking of doing it like on the surface in a hut somewhere. But in thinking about that, if I had it underground, the advantage would be I could fish up armored cave fish very easily and I can oh look at those worms I can use those to make some endurance potions which give me plus 10% defense which is pretty nice actually all throughout the game like I'll need a lot of those but I would also like to get to the ocean since there's some great items I can get over there oh I oh a worm um I am kind of curious what's down here, though. Like, I didn't check it out earlier, right? 
Uh, is there anything fun? I should really get some clay so I can... Okay. Should I check it out? Yeah, let's do it. I do have the glow stick, so... I can at least kind of peek down here if there's anything. Uh, no, there's not really. I do get that darn chilled debuff, which is rather unfortunate, seeing as this does not look very cold at all. But I guess it is. Oh, well, that's fine. Such is life, right? Mmm. I really do need to get some of that clay. Because I don't have access to the planter pots for a while. Yeah, let's go ahead and mine this up. I can at least make the, uh... They're not planter pots, the planter boxes. Those are really nice. They're definitely my favorite thing for, you know, making a nice kind of plant farm. But you know what? These will work. I just hate growing them on the grass because then I accidentally break all of them whenever I try to harvest them. It's such a pain. But with this, it should be just fine. At least I would hope. Because they'll just kind of grow in the, the pots, I guess. Maybe I could even make a brick house. Uh, I don't know about that, but I mean, I could. I could. Oh, there's more clay up there. Hmm. You know what? I should probably make a platform to cross this. All right. We'll do it that way then. Oh, I hate it when that happens. Man, I've gotten so many strange plants. Look at that. All right, let me grab the... Can I? Can I? Oh, there we go. There we go. I got it. Everything's good in the world. I did indeed get that strange plant, which is what I really wanted. Okay, so I need to get some snow because I want to grow boreal wood because it is awesome and it looks really great. Oh, you know what? I should also fill up this bucket so I can do stuff with it later. Um, all right. Let me break this tree. Because, again, I want to get plenty of wood. I really want the boreal wood, but it's okay if I don't get it. You know, it's fine. All right, this guy, though. Hmm, frozen slime. They're not actually that bad. Or ice slime. I'm sorry. It's only got 60 health. So, you know, it's not like it's unreasonable to deal with. But, you know, you, you probably want to have more than a copper short sword while fighting it, I guess. All right, let me get some snow blocks. Now, I wish I could use this ice block stuff because you can make ice torches and then you can make frost burn arrows and that's really helpful for hard or for expert mode because they inflict a debuff and it does a lot of damage over time oh you don't even care about me well gee i don't care about you you're just a slime you're just a blue slime even um Oh, hey, that thing has some stuff in it. Wow, they don't even care about me. It's like they just don't even see me. Hey, open your eyes, slime! Because I know you totally have some eyes. Wow, 13 tin ore. I didn't even have to mine it. Uh-oh. I have a bad feeling. Mm -mm. Okay, do you see how it's getting... Oh, man, I see it. Down there, there's the crimson! The crimson is coming! The crimson is coming! Brace yourselves! All right, well, nothing we can really do about that other than check it. Oh my goodness, I hear it, there's a spider. Oh, blood crawler. Oh yeah, not really, not up for this right now. No way. Yeah, those spiders, they can be pretty nasty. How am I on money? And I actually am not really that wealthy right now, so that's fine. I mean, I could check it out without much risk. Like, I mean, if I die, okay, big deal. I don't really want to make a habit of dying, but, you know, I usually like to deposit my money first. Man, look at that thing. That thing is just gnarly looking. Now, what can I do against that? Ah, uh, do I want to try to oh, fight it? I don't know, man. I don't know. I think we're going to go for it. Let's... Oh, no, 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 no. I'm done. Uh, <laughs> I'm done. I am so done. Uh, yeah, so that's... This is the Crimson. We're kind of entering the Crimson area. I'm getting out of here. I'm sorry. They're, I'm done. <laughs> you know what? Not happening to me, man. Not happening to me. That could have been really bad. All right, so Tordak, the demolitionist. It's a good day to die. Yeah, 
<laughs> no kidding. I was almost there, man. Um, I could probably get more grenades. I think these will be really helpful early on. Uh, yeah, because I can't really do my cheesy thing where I, you know, go to the places earlier than I should. Like, I could take the bombs and go to the Crimson and smash the stuff and get really cool stuff. I could do that normally, but I'm restricting that. And I'm restricting the ice arrows. Ooh, snowballs. Well, I don't really know what else to do. Man, I got a lot of strange plants. That's actually quite strange to have so many. Um, didn't I have, yeah, look, I got like four. Bring it on, man, bring it on. Okay, well, I think I'm actually gonna end things here, but I think what I wanna do maybe between episodes is work on like somewhere that I can fish. Ooh, that's not that inconvenient to get to. It would save me a lot of time. I don't know. I just need something to do to occupy myself during nighttime. And I need to get on fishing. I definitely want to go all the way over to the ocean and get the fisherman guy. But yeah, we'll do that next time. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you on the next episode of Maryland's Terraria Expert Mode Adventure. See you next time, uh, face monsters. Yeah, that's a thing now. That's a thing. <laughs>